All right, good evening, builders. Uh, it's been a while since I've done a video. I know my brother posted one about his RV9, so I figured I'd post one about mine. So, uh, last time I did a video on the progress I was making, I had worked on doing primer on the now bottom side of the wing. Uh, since then, I did a lot of filling and sanding to get this side ready. Uh, last weekend, I actually shot a coat of primer on it, and I had an issue with my paint gun. Uh, it looked like I had a bunch of pinholes everywhere, and uh, I could actually see the lower, the layer below it. Uh, I don't know what it was. I attributed it to possibly it being too cold or contamination, so I ended up having to sand this all the way back down to the layer below it, prepping it again, and getting ready for paint. And then uh, I had it ready yesterday. Uh, but since I thought it was too cold the previous time and I didn't have a heater, I decided to kind of go into winter mode and do other work. Uh, that work accomplished was, you can't really see it now because I'm doing some filler, but I ended up pulling the motor off uh, the airplane and installing all the uh, cam locks, which are kind of covered right now from filler, but I did all the cam lock uh, mounts drilled and got the cam lock set for this. Did a little work on the inside, got uh, the headset jacks done, did some wiring cleanup uh, in there, um, did some stuff. And then today I went out and bought a nice heater so that I could uh, warm up the garage again. So I was able to get the garage warmed up to like 70 degrees. Shot another coat of primer on today and I had the actual same issue. I don't know if the camera will pick this up, but I have all these little dots it looked like I almost threw a thing of sand on the wing. Um, I did a lot of work cleaning out the garage and had no dust issues. Uh, I think what I figured out today was I had an issue with my paint guns. So the first coat of primer went on fine. And when I took the paint gun apart, there was a little itty bitty ring. This is the spare. This ring stuck in the paint gun, and I think when I cleaned it out, it got cocked off. And so when I was spraying, my air horns on the sides were filling up with paint. And I think that's what caused the spatter. So I have all these spatter along the wing. So I'm going to have to sand this down again. I'll uh, take it back down to the previous layer. I've already reset the ring the way it should be. And uh, hopefully the next quick couple coats won't have that issue um whatever it happens so while i'm waiting for this to dry up enough to where i can block sand it i've got another work done i've laid up a rough coat of filler on my rudder so i can block that down i've done some filler here to uh create like a little joggle so that my uh cowling isn't sticking up over my front deck so I have an initial fill here once that dries and then I did a, a layer right here to close in the gap between the camping and the front deck once these two things cure I'll pull this duct tape off here and here and then I'll do initial fill here and then uh, we'll keep on working anyways guys uh, that's my update for my build Hope you guys are getting work done in the new year. Happy Martin Luther King Day and keep on building. See ya.